Our topic today is how insulin resistance impacts male fertility and male hormone issues, uh, including low T, uh, erectile dysfunction, and other components. And, and this kind of, I'll, I'll turn it over to Ben to kind of introduce it in a minute, but the, the subject kind of started because we talk a lot about PCOS uh, and infertility with, with females, and we get a lot of questions about male infertil infertility and, uh, and hormone problems. And so we decided, or Dr. Bickman decided, that it might be a good topic for conversation today. So I'm going to turn the time over to Dr. Bickman to lead this discussion, after which we'll come back and do some Q&A. Yeah, yeah, thanks, thanks, Jack. Yeah, so from our conversation last week, we spoke about uh, uh, polycystic ovarian syndrome and how insulin has a direct effect at inhibiting the ovaries ability in a woman of converting testosterone into estrogens uh, and, because that's an essential switch that, 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 that conversion. So again, as I, I'm sure I said last week, all estrogens, which is a family of hormones were once testosterone. And then women just convert more of that than men do, but men, of course, convert some as well. And of course, last week when we spoke about polycystic ovary syndrome, some of the guys were, they felt a little left out, right? They wanted a conversation about metabolic health and fertility.